There is fallout tonight from the sexual harassment allegation against Congressman Tom Reed. Good evening, I'm Claudine Ewing. It's resulting in Reed ditching his expected run for governor next year and a decision to exit Congress after his current term expires. We get the latest on this developing story from Channel 2's Dave McKinley. In a statement, the six-term Southern Tier congressman said, first, I apologize to Nicolette Davis. She is the woman who says Reed sexually harassed and inappropriately touched her during a lobbying trip to Minnesota in 2017. Reed said that when she went public on Friday with the claim that it was the first he'd heard of it, and despite indicating he did not recall the incident as she described it, stated that, I hear her voice and will not dismiss her. Simply put, my behavior caused her pain, showed her disrespect, and was unprofessional. I was wrong, I am sorry, and I take full responsibility. Reed also apologized to his wife, children, and constituents and acknowledged his battle with alcoholism, writing, I want to share that this occurred at a time in my life in which I was struggling. Upon entering treatment in 2017, I recognized that I am powerless over alcohol. I am now approaching four years of that personal lifelong journey of recovery. He went on to state, this is in no way an excuse for anything I've done. Consistent with my recovery, I publicly take ownership of my past actions, offer this amends and humbly apologize again to Miss Davis and to all of you. Reed, who had been considering a run for governor next year, had been staunchly critical of Governor Cuomo, calling for his resignation after now eight women have accused the governor of sexual harassment or unwanted touching. Cuomo has called those allegations lodged by all those women false while staunchly refusing to step down. Reed says he will now not run for governor next year, nor will he seek re-election to Congress when his current term expires, although that does fall in line with a previous pledge he made to serve no more than six terms. Dave McKinley, Channel 2 News. Dave, thank you. In a statement, New York State Republican Party Chairman Nick Langworthy commended Reed for taking real accountability and says Reed made the right decision. Langworthy also expressed hope that this will bring Nicolette Davis some peace. He also wished Reed continued strength in his recovery from alcohol dependency.